हॉट वेदर कॉन्क्रीटिंग प्रिकॉशंस एंड अफेक्ट्स कॉन्क्रीटिंग इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ कॉन्क्रीट बैचिंग मिक्सिंग ट्रांसपोर्टिंग प्लेसिंग कंपैक्टिंग एंड इन प्लेस एट्सट्रो एंड इट्स द मोस्ट एसेंशियल प्रोसीजर फॉर ईच एंड एवरी कंस्ट्रक्शन फॉर इट्स क्वालिटी एंड ड्यूरेबिलिटी द कॉन्क्रीटिंग प्रोसीजर इज अफेक्टेड बाई द टेम्परेचर ह्यूमिडिटी एंड अदर इन्वायरमेंटल फैक्टर्स different precaution needs to be exercised when you are concreting it or in the hot weather concreting if you want to work in such situations or condition when you have to take precautions here we are going to describe the hot weather concreting the knowledge about hot weather concreting is most essential in the areas with extremely high ambient temperatures such as in the arabian peninsula it may be necessary to cool the concrete prior to placing it for example by replacing part of the water in the mix with flaked ice or in many other ways if you want to know a general procedure such as batching mixing transportation placing and compaction what temperature is too hot for concreting hot weather conditions are commonly encountered in summer but it's also a combination of other climate factors such as high wind velocity low humidity and solar reaction which can occur at any time or in any season especially in arid and tropical climate the definition of hot weather may change from nation to nation depending upon local caudal provision which are defined after study of local conditions according to indian code IS 7861 part 1 1175 hot weather condition arises when any of the operations of concreting is done at atmospheric temperatures above 40 degree celsius or 104 degree fahrenheit and any of the operation of concreting excluding steam curing where the temperature of concrete at the time of its placement is expected to be behind 40 degree celsius or 104 degree fahrenheit according to australian standard as 13791 hot weather condition arises when placing of concrete is done at a temperature above 30 degree celsius and the maximum concrete temperature is above a 35 degree celsius according to the national ready mix concrete association usa hot weather as defined by aci 305 or is any combination of the following conditions that tends to impair the quality of freshly mixed or hardened concrete by accelerating the rate of moisture loss and rate of cement hydration or otherwise causing detrimental result due to high ambient temperature high concrete temperature low relative humidity solar radiation how the high temperature can affect the concrete you read in a previous article named cold weather concreting how low temperature affect concrete similarly high temperature also has effect on concrete in the fresh concrete high atmospheric temperature increases the temperature of concrete due to this the rate of hydration increases and it leads to accelerated setting high temperature leads to rapid evaporation of moisture from exposed surfaces and it may cause plastic shrinkage cracking and creasing and subsequent cooling of hardened concrete can introduce tensile in stress thus the special attention has to be paid to curing in the hot weather concreting then under normal ambient conditions in the hot weather concreting water demand increases which will increase water cement ratio and in turn lower potential strength it also tends to accelerate loss of slump or workability of concrete and make it difficult to place and will affect the finish of concrete effects of hot weather on concrete one early setting or stiffening of concrete as discussed above in the hot weather concreting due to the higher temperature the setting time of concrete will be reduced and will result in the early stiffening and loss of slump or workability 
it gives the poor quality of hydration and will suffer a certain loss of long term strength partially set concrete may reduce the bond between the consecutive lifts more than anticipated and also gives an adverse effect on placing and finishing of concrete 2 evaporation of mixing water hot weather concreting is normally associated with lower relative humidity due to this the water mixed with the concrete to give the required workability will be lost with the result concrete turns into unworkable and therefore an excessive amount of compaction is required to compact concrete fully if this is not done large voids will remain in the concrete which are responsible for all the ills and problems in concrete 3 workability or slump of concrete loss of workability or slump due to high temperature is the major difficulty that arises with hot weather concreting it affects the concreting operations like placing compaction and finishing addition of extra water to improve the workability or slump of the concrete mix decreases the strength and increases the permeability and ultimately affects the durability of the concrete four compressive strength hot weather concreting increases the water demand due to high temperature both can reduce the 28 days strength of concrete by adding more water to maintain workability it increases the water cement ratio and results in loss of strength and durability it may also increase the drawing shrinkage of hardened concrete 5 less time for finishing finishing of concrete work must be done as early as possible after placing of concrete particularly in the hot weather concreting in certain cases if early finishing is not possible due to faster stiffening or setting and quicker evaporation of water the quality of finishing will be of poor standard generally extra fresh mortar is required to be applied for finishing which results in poor performance 6 absorption of water in hot weather regions the subgrade or formwork is normally dry and absorptive thus the subgrade or surface of formwork is required to be wetted before placing the concrete If this is not done carefully and with proper concern the water in the concrete may be lost by absorption by the surface in contact with concrete making the contact zone poorer in quality 7 curing of concrete for the hot weather concreting early curing becomes necessary because hot weather requires a continuous effect for curing of concrete if there is any interval or interruption then it makes concrete surface dry fast and interrupts the continuous hydration which gives an adverse effect on the development of its full strength it plastic shrinkage cracking in the hot weather concreting hot weather accelerated the loss of moisture from the surface if the evaporation rate is greater than the bleeding rate it makes the surface dry resulting in shrinkage of the concrete cracking occurs when the shrinkage stresses exceed the tensile capacity of the concrete plastic shrinkage cracks may be quite deep and continue to widen until the shrinkage stresses are relieved 9 thermal cracking thermal cracking is a result of the thermal gradient when concrete is placed the heat of hydration increases the interior temperature of the concrete on another side due to rapid changes in the temperature of the external concrete surface that is when concrete slabs pavement or walls are placed on a hot day followed by a cool night it may lead to thermal gradient between the hot interior of concrete and the colder external surface of the concrete the hotter interior provides a restraint to the colder external surface which wants to contract which will lead to thermal cracks points precautions to remember while hot weather concreting one pre preparations of hot weather concreting make a proper schedule for hot weather concreting 
The concreting can be done in time when the temperature is not high, such as it can be scheduled in the early morning, in the day time, or in late afternoon when the ambient temperature is low. For hot weather concreting, provide sufficient labor and machinery to minimize the time required to place and finish the concrete as hot weather conditions has considerably short time for initial and final set of concrete. Erect temporary wind breakers to limit wind velocities. Erect sunshade to reduce the temperature of the concrete surface. Keep all the stocks ingredient like fine and coarse aggregate as cool as possible by making the shades on the stalks and the sprinkling of water on the stalks. See that water cement ratio does not increase. For the hot weather concreting, moisten the subgrade steel reinforcement and form work before concrete placement to reduce water absorption from concrete mix. 2. Material and mix proportions for hot weather concreting. For hot weather concreting, use material and mix design proportion having good weather resistance, that is select sand having low specific heat and so on. Use concrete having adequate consistency that allows rapid placement and consolidations. To reduce the initial temperature of concrete, Use cool aggregates and cool water ice in hot weather concreting. Take care to see that water cement ratio does not increase. In the hot weather concreting, aggregate temperature can be maintained by watering or keeping them covered. Use of low heat cement is preferable for hot weather concreting. Use of retarding admixtures to counter premature stiffening or setting of the fresh mix for hot weather concreting. 3. Pouring concrete. During the hot weather concreting, protect the concrete surface with plastic sheeting or use evaporation retarders to maintain the initial moisture in the concrete mixture. Hot weather concreting might be done in a covered environment. Use cooling containers, pipelines, chutes, etc. during the transportation of wet concrete. During hot weather concreting, complete the concreting operations like transporting, placing and finishing of concrete as fast as is practicable or possible. During the hot weather concreting, immediately follow the initial finishing spraying a fine film of allopathic alcohol over the exposed concrete for reducing the evaporation of water 4 curing in hot weather concreting consider fogging the area above the concrete placement to rise the relative humidity and satisfy moisture demand of the ambient air for hot weather concreting, provide appropriate curing methods as soon as possible after the finishing of concrete. You can use the more efficient way for curing than the water curing in hot weather concreting, such as curing blankets, plastic sheets, and concrete curing compounds.